Working efficiently with ChatGPT is all about prompting. If your prompting is good, then you can leverage the full potential of ChatGPT or similar generative AI tools. If you look at this list, in this list, you would see that the quality of instruction is a paramount. For example, you need to focus on your tone as what should be your tone as per your use case. If you are trying to create some standard operating procedures for your company, then don't make your tone casual. If you are trying to create um, some sort of legal document, again, your tone should be formal and persuasive. But if you're just creating an essay or de um, devising a letter or anything casual, then the tone should be accordingly. Other than that, there are a lot of things that you need to take care of that your language should um, match with your response that you're expecting. If you're trying to get some quotes, then request inclusion of relevant quotes and also give ChatGPT some examples. If you check at line um, number 21, there's a call to action. So if you want ChatGPT to produce something, then tell ChatGPT to do so. Don't just assume that just from the text which you have pasted in, in ChatGPT, the ChatGPT would be able to infer and give you the correct answer. It might be, but it is always helpful to guide ChatGPT in the right direction. After looking at these prompting points, one thing you could imagine that think of how improved the work of humans would be if they were given this quality of instructions but then the thing is that humans are independent and now it seems like chat gpt could be made to ask some subset of these questions up front also great workers ask for clarification when the boss is not clear i'm not sure if chat gpt can do that I hope that this was interesting. If you have any feedback, please put it in the comment section. Thank you.